Well, we did all the Black Ops maps here, and now on to the classic zombies maps, which are World at War 1. Hey guys, it's Gum here, and we are back with more Call of Duty Black Ops. The last time we did Moon, and the last of the Black Ops maps, and now on to the, doing the World at War maps here, and I decided that, that, that I think I'm gonna try to do these ones here by myself, or maybe the last one I'll do with people. Well, mainly because to try to speed up the process a bit, because this whole zombie thing went on a little li longer than I thought it would. But, eh, oh well. Oh, so. Oh, yeah, I guess we're just. Uh, so, I guess that's just something to do. <laughs> What's with this music here? Okay. <laughs> But yeah, so one the first one here with this nocturnal turn and then we run on over here we got Yeah, we got mule kick over here. And that's the only perk that's on this map. So uh and uh, uh, yeah. Shit. So yeah, we need to open that door and <laughs> so, yeah, I've been thinking, yeah, if I recall correctly, this is the smallest out of all the zombie, all the maps. The of which, hmm, eh, oh well. Oh, and, yeah, oh, yeah, and I, the box, I believe, stays in one spot I, oh, the whole time. And, you know, and, see, I think it's up here. Oh no. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I could have sworn I saw it was up around here, or maybe it was on the lower level. Yeah, I do require tons more money. I need to open up stuff here. Right, that's one round down. <laughs> and yeah, this map does make appearances again in like later Black Ops games. Like it makes an appearance in Black Ops Two and Cold War, and I'm not sure about three or four. Or but two and Cold War are the only ones I know for a fact that this map appears in. So yeah, and. <clears throat> uh, <clears throat> So I guess I'll open the store up next since the box will be here. And it's quite a good a lot of barriers in here where the zombies can enter from. <laughs> but yeah, here, here now we're just doing the World at War maps, but I never played World at War, but uh, I do know World at War is the first time that zombies was introduced. It's then I don't know how much of the map would change from the World at War ones, but hmm. I would imagine they're not too far off. Okay, yeah, there's the box down there, and that yeah, just connects to back to where we were before. Uh, it, yeah, and this box is unique because it's on the floor and and it doesn't move at all. It stays in the same spot. Dude, dude. Yeah, I, now I just have the knife to knife them. Mm, you. Yeah, so let's knife around the people we win. Yeah, you can also see kind of why you know, I wanted to do these map, the zombie maps with other people, because it makes it a little more interesting. Him too, and just a little bit more funnier because you know you don't know what your other player would do. Like, what if it's just do something stupid or or just help you get food to the end and just uh, oh well, at least get help you get to where you need to go, like pack punches, even though 
The only pokes that are on this map is Mule Kick. And that's all. So that makes this. So that just kind of makes map pretty bare bones. I'm not sure if Mule Kick was there originally. I would imagine it was. Yeah, but nice view though of the moon. And so, yeah, I mean, they were just wrapped around to the, up here and oh, okay, it was a barrier I can rebuild outside of a plane crash right here. And here's another one. And there's one over there and I see a zombie coming towards that one. Question is, can I? Yeah. Well, Matt can't get any more points, but. Oh, <laughs> yeah, grenade is a little different there. I didn't even hit one. <laughs> yeah, I have to keep looking behind me to make sure no. I can't even hit them. <laughs> Okay, that helps. <laughs> well, I'll grab a, well, I'll just grab a gun now and give me something good. Ah, better than nothing. <laughs> but yeah, I haven't really done much of the turning around and picking up random weapon thing from the box there. Although it. This is kind of bad, it's a little bit more, more experience to it, you don't know what you're going to get, but what? Ooh, wait, ooh, and R. Oh. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> right, it's not Black Ops 3, because cause I have the, because I could dive in this one, not, not slide, because I was playing, because, <laughs> like, after I finished, like, doing, recording, like, well, not like right after, like sometime after I finished recording the Moon for Black Ops 1, I played the Moon on Black Ops 3 with some people, and we actually managed to complete the Easter egg. And so, that was cool. Well, I was glad I was able to pull that off, and event. They were saying it takes some, takes place like before, you know, like Nuketown or and Black Ops 2 and Transit. And Black Ops 2, so that's cool. Kind of connects the whole maps together in a way. <laughs> so does that mean the people who are up on the moon just stay there forever, or they do they come back in like like a later map in in Black Ops 3 or 4? Huh? I don't. Know. Not the one to know about that. <laughs> but yeah, does that uh, sure make some? Sure, yeah, sure, yeah, like, I don't know what I'm saying at this point. Yeah, sure, the maps are, I could have also shown the um, moon on, like, a couple of the Black Ops 1 maps on Black Ops 3, but, eh, I always wanted to show, play them up, show them on the actual game I'm playing on here, not that, and, yeah, and I will eventually do, like, Black Ops 3, and, and I, don't, I don't know if I'll actually show off the yeah, show off the new maps there that they brought back. Eh, eh, maybe I'll do it. Make it kind of quick. But, eh, oh, I don't know. Oh, well. Well, I haven't decided on that yet, because I won't be doing Black Ops 3 after I do Black Ops 2. I'll be taking another break from the Call of Duty games for a while after that. I complete two, so... And don't know if I'll do them next year or the year after that. Who, who knows? Who knows? I'll, I'll figure that out in no time. Hmm. Yeah. We'll just make. Yeah. Zombies are getting over on here and do. Next ammo. Get that help. I actually want to open up this little dresser here. Ooh. 
Okay, I may have just screwed myself by not holding on my pistol now. Oh, um, well, I mean, it, I mean, this kind of works. Uh, double points there, but. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, at this point, I've technically shown off. Oh god. Yeah, well, there we go. Yeah. I shot off my. <laughs> Still said this line after I went down, but. Uh, it only lasted five rounds. <laughs> but yeah, it was a pretty small map, so there wasn't really too much to it. But yeah, that's one map done. And. Oh! Right, yeah, right, it makes you restart when you go down. <laughs> but I tried to, right, so before I started recording, I tried doing this one for people, see if I can get some people to work for me here, but I haven't got, uh, I wasn't any successful at that, so. So I guess I'm going solo for this one here. And Slowing screen's pretty cool. You get like a little a map of the yeah a map of the oh, whole air, whole map here. <laughs> here I'm showing you where all the perks are. Yeah, the X is on where you start and yeah yeah look. So what what makes this map so cool, interesting and cool is that uh, yeah this door here. If you're playing this like. Well, at least in co-op, or at least with four people. Two people will start on this side here, and two will start on that side over there, and you have to work your way around to get to each other. So, that, that's a pretty cool idea for a map. And you meet up at, like, power. Or so. Yeah, it's a cool idea for a map. <laughs> uh, for and unlike the uh, last map we just did, this one has has more perks with it. It had quick revive, five, two, and then has speed, cola, double tap, and juggernaut. Sadly, no pack punch on this map. If you just add pack punch on this map, then this would be a good one to play over. Granted, I would still play this regardless of that. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, and I guess I can also show this often. You know, quick vibe. Yeah, even though the power's not on, they give you quick vibe because it operates differently. And when you're playing single player, and oh, he was mule kick. It's over here. Mm -hmm. I guess I forgot that was there. Yeah. So we. Um, I definitely like to map more than not to him because of the idea it has where you set two people have to make their way around the map to meet up with each other, you know. using my ammo because I want to save it a bit. <laughs> and then charge! Boom. There we go. Barrier's not re being rebuilt now. Well, what well, it is, it's just not getting a point from it. What it meant. this up and box is on this map and it does have multiple locations to it and let's see I don't know what the box is though unfortunately yeah lots more money yeah this is a trap here that you can activate but needs power first 
Because there's a couple out here like it causes like an electric trap that will that you can use to lower zombies into. Mm. Nothing over here. <laughs> well, double points that now. Speed colors here. Should prob probably would be better for me to just buy a gun. Only one of them at a time. Oh, that. Mm. <sighs> oh, I wanted to kill that elf. Crazy. Oh, that's. Gun is too expensive for me to get. Mm, 50, I don't have enough yet. Just need like one more zombie to kill. Well, might as well take. Okay, you know, one insignia advantage of the instant kill while we're still going. Mm, let's see, no. But hey, at least we can have turn on the power when doors on both sides are open. Mm. Uh. Uh. Well, yeah, now the power is activated, so. Oh, and as for the boxes, it. Oh, here it is. I guess it stays in the same spot as well. Oh, but yeah, this is where the other side you would meet up on here would be, so. Mm, not where I wanted to throw that. Okay, good. It's enough for me to get the box. Yeah, you fire, 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 Fight zombies. Mm -hmm. and grab no guns because I need more ammo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess I might as well open this up. And yeah, I do like how these leaking waters are around the place. So it's like you could just take a shower, especially here since this is a shower. <laughs> I think that gun over there was a good, a good one to get. <laughs> yeah, here's this one since. Ah, five. My almost out of ammo fence. And open that up, double tap egg. Not sure if I passed the word juggernaut was. Hmm. Hmm. Kaboom. <laughs> I guess another advantage of doing this, you know, by myself is that I can control when I want the game to end and and then not have to last as long as other, well, everyone else is. So that yeah, no good thing about playing by myself. Sure, I love buying up new ammo when I'm about to get a max ammo. Yeah. Uh. 
Oh, oh, yeah, that's a ton of them. <laughs> Ooh, it's the kill, okay, that helped. Yeah. I can knife you all! Yeah, and you notice how, how, like, actually, wait a minute. Yep, <laughs> you can flush the toilet. Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay, there you go. And, yeah, so I'm back up on this side, and it was what Juggernaut is. Just, uh, yeah. Well, the, now we've made a complete circle around the place. You see, so. I think I've practically showed every part of the map. I mean, yeah, I didn't go in every room yet, uh, So. Oh. Uh, yeah, but. See what I can do about that. Mm -hmm. And well. But yeah, I'll grab a drink. Mm. Yeah, and double points, okay. And <laughs> okay, big points there. Yeah, I'm getting 1200 points from there. Well, as I'm buy some. I'm double tap you. <laughs> And then I guess to get speed call and then I can just rack up here as long as I can. Oh god, I hear someone at the doorbell. I can't do this now, please. Hey, it's uh it's, uh I guess that's what I get for calling this during the day. I mean like if I knew I was going to just do this by myself, I would have wa waited till nighttime. And but oh well. Mm. Oh god, this is not going well here. Yeah, this is what happens when you go down. You get like these pistols that like shoot grenades to uh, to kill off zombies in your area. Here and yeah, maybe that's the person who just was well, just from UPS who rang the doorbell there. <laughs> and kills me. I know you, UPS does that. Uh, been do, done that too much. I put lice here. Yeah, so I'll have to check that out after and right. Ran out of perks. You lose all your perks when you go down. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, at least it's like Black Ops 2, some of the maps they except for I think Origins and um, Mob of the Dead and uh, Nuke Town. When you go down you don't lose all uh, you don't lose all of your and I so you lose like one. There we have speed color. Hey, yeah, mate. Like, showing off all this area. I think over here I didn't show much, but I don't think I'll last much longer here. Yeah, let's see it. Well, well, I definitely showed off every area here at this point. But what the hell? I haven't been loaded and go, but eh, showed off every. Eh, I showed off pretty much every area here. Here, so yeah, that's two maps down. So we just got two more left here, and then we can be done with all the zombies maps.